Today's video is going to be on how to utilize the Yield Analysis Center within the FieldView app. First of all, we're going to open up the app of just FieldView, second from the bottom right hand corner, so I'll click there. This brings us to our main splash screen with all of our different icons here. I always like to point out in the upper right hand corner, if we're trying to select a different operation, let's say that we're a dealer helping a grower or we're just a grower helping another grower that's shared with us, um, we can choose our operation up here and whichever one we have selected, that's what the Yield Analysis Center is going to be working on. So first of all, we're going to go to the Yield Analysis, uh, and that's in the lower left hand tile there. If you just click on Corner Beans, it'll take you into the Yield Analysis Center. Now this is showing for 2016 on my operation. We actually have a little more data in 2015, so I'm going to quickly go up in the upper right hand corner and just switch it over to 2015, leaving it on corn. Here we can see that in 2015 we had seven fields, however many acres we had harvested, total bushels. Um, this is an okay screen, you know, it can break down kind of what our overall operation is doing quickly, but it doesn't tell much of things that we don't already know as farmers. What's really cool is if you look right under yield analysis in the top center, we can click over to hybrids, and now we can really start breaking down performance. So what hybrids did we have? What did each one individually yield? What was our overall average yield across there? So not only can we sort by average yield, but where it has harvested at the top, we can also sort by how many acres. So let's say there's a couple big hitter products that we know that we have on a lot more acres than other ones. What are those really performing like? Are those a product that we really want to use again? Is it an old standby that needs to be switched out for something that's really yielding better? Um, also when we look there, so let's take for example 62.8, the second one down. We have the ability with the little arrow on the right hand side, if we click on there, to look to see, you know, was that product planted in multiple fields? What was its yield in each of those fields? So for this example, it was only in one of our fields. And then we can also look under that yield analysis center up there, under soils. So how did it do across different soil types across all of our operation? Uh, really breaking it down a couple layers deep of how is this product best fit for our acres and our operation in future years. The last part that I wanted to point out here, right up next to my Josh Merriman's operation in the upper right hand corner, we have a square with an up circle to it. So if we see something interesting in one of these reports that we want to share, we can click on that square and now we have a PDF that um, easily kind of breaks out what yield report and what we've drilled down into it. If we click that circle or that square with the triangle pointing up again, we can decide whether or not we'd want to send it via message, mail, have the ability to print it, um, really do whatever we want with this data that makes sense for us in our operation. Good luck analyzing your data this fall, guys.